should be clear from here. Normandy's touched down at the base, but it looks like we're grounded. The Solarian captain can explain when you get here. There is the Solarian camp. So what are we supposed to do now? Stay put until we can come up with a plan. Are you in charge here? What's the situation? I'm Captain Kirahi, 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG. You and your crew have just landed in the middle of a hot zone. Every AA gun within 10 miles has been alerted to your presence. What are we supposed to do in the meantime? We stay put until the Council sends the reinforcements we requested. We are the reinforcements. What? You're all they sent? I told the Council to send a fleet. We couldn't understand your transmission. They sent me to investigate. That is a repetition of our task. I lost half my men investigating this place. So what have you found? Saren's base of operations. He set up a research facility here, but it's crawling with Geth and very well fortified. What's Saren researching? He's using the facility to breed an army of Krogan. How is that possible? Apparently Saren has discovered a cure for the Genophage. The Geth are bad enough, but a Krogan army? He'd be almost unstoppable. Exactly my thoughts. We must ensure that this facility and its secrets are destroyed. Destroyed? I don't think so. Our people are dying. This cure can save them. If that cure leaves this planet, the Krogan will become unstoppable. We can't make the same mistake again. We are not a mistake. Is he going to be a problem? We already have enough angry Krogan to deal with. He'll be fine. I'll talk to him. I'd appreciate that, Commander. My men and I need to rethink our plan of attack. Can you give us some time? Go ahead, Captain. I'll come back soon. We won't be long, Commander. In the meantime, if you need any supplies, you can talk to Commander Rentola. He's in one of the tents nearby. Looks like things are a bit of a mess. Yeah. I wouldn't be so worried if it wasn't for Rex. It looks like he's gonna blow a gasket. You think I should go talk to him? It wouldn't hurt. Well, it might, actually. Just do it carefully. I'll be careful, but be ready, just in case. I'm always ready. This isn't right, Shepard. If there's a cure for the Genophage, we can't destroy it. Calm down, Rex. I'm not the enemy here. Saren's the one you should be mad at. Really? Saren created a cure for my people. You want to destroy it. Help me out here, Shepard. The lines between friend and foe are getting a little blurry from where I stand. This isn't a cure, it's a weapon! And if Saren is allowed to use it, you won't be around to reap the benefits. None of us will. That's a chance we should be willing to take. This is the fate of my entire people we're talking about. If you can't give me a better reason than this to destroy the hopes of my people, then I'm done with you. I can't let you jeopardize the mission. So that's it. All this time and that's all I get from you. How can you not see what this means to the Krogan? This base can't be destroyed. I won't allow it. These Krogan are slaves of Saren. Puppets. Tools to be used and discarded. Is that what you want for your people? 
No, we were tools for the Council once. To thank us for wiping out the Rachni, they neutered us all. I doubt Saren will be as generous. Alright, Shepard. You've made your point. I don't like this, but I trust you enough to follow your lead. Just one thing. When we find Saren, I want his head. Thank you for speaking with the Krogan. The assault on Saren's base will be difficult enough as it is. I assume that means you've come up with a plan. Of sorts. We can convert our ship's drive system into a 20 kiloton ordnance. Crude, but effective. Nice. Drop that nuke from orbit, and Saren can kiss his Turian ass goodbye. Unfortunately, the facility is too well fortified for that. We'll need to place the bomb at a precise location. Where do we take the nuke, and how do we get there? The bomb must be taken to the far side of the facility. Your ship can drop it off, but we'll need to infiltrate the base, disable the AA guns, and pacify any ground forces first. You want us to go in on foot? We don't have enough men. We won't be able to meet their force head on. Definitely not. But I think we can work around that. I'm going to divide my men into three teams and hit the front of the facility. While we've got their attention, you can sneak your shadow team in the back. It's a good idea, but your people are going to get slaughtered. We're tougher than we look, Commander. But it's true. I don't expect many of us will make it out alive. And that makes what I'm going to ask even more difficult. I need one of your men to accompany me. To help coordinate the teams. You expect me to commit one of my people to your command? We are all soldiers by trade. If your people are not prepared to face such a risk, would you really want them by your side? He's right, Commander. We can't do this without both teams at their best. I volunteer. Not so fast, LT. Commander Shepard will need you to arm the nuke. I'll go with the Salarians. With all due respect, Gunnery Chief, it's not your place to decide. Why is it that whenever someone says, with all due respect, they really mean kiss my ass? This is my decision, not yours. Either of these two will do, Commander. Both seem willing to sacrifice their lives if necessary, though if we are lucky, such sacrifices won't be required. Williams! You'll accompany the Captain. No heroics, understood? Aye, aye, Commander. I will have the ordinance loaded onto the Normandy and brief your crew on its detonation sequencing. Do you have any questions before we go, Commander? I want to know more about the bomb. How reliable is it going to be? Its reliability depends on the person arming it, but it will do the job. The drive system is highly impervious to damage from external sources. Once it has been armed, very little can stop it. The key is getting it into place and armed before the Geth can stop us. Let's do this. Excellent. Then if you'll excuse me, I need to prepare my men. <laughs> 